sorry, man. I am, uh, I'm just savoring the moment. Oh, taking my sweet ass time. All right, fellas. First order of business. So, wait, 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 wait. One damn minute. I'm supposed to be the alpha, right? I mean, the only reason I'm asking is I'm a little bit confused. If I'm the alpha, why is someone who is most definitely not the alpha holding the badass shotgun? That is what I'm talking about. That feels good. Right? I mean, I never had a kid of my own, but if I did, I would imagine this is what it's like holding your baby for the very first time, except for it turns out my baby can kill people by spitting bullets at them. Daryl, kneel to the alpha. Starting to get real now, ain't it? Dar, you were right when you said that I liked it. The fact is, I like it a lot. You should probably shoot me. Don't threaten me with a good time. <laughs> <laughs> Tommy, oh. <laughs> now, I don't know what kind of lying assholes you've been dealing with, but I'm a man of my word. <laughs> Speak what you're spoken to! You answer to me! You provide for me! I provide for you. Who the hell do you think you're talking to? Are you confused about who we are? Are you confused about who is in charge? Welcome to a brand new beginning, you sorry shits. Pardon me, young man. Excuse the shit out of my goddamn French. As a token of my gratitude, I'm gonna send you over a few of my wives to your apartment tonight, show you a good time. Did you say wives mean in plural? Hell, yes I did. Punishment is how we built everything we have. What's about to happen is gonna be hard to watch. I don't wanna do it. I wish I could just ignore the rules and let it slide, but I can't. All the same to you. I just, just stay here and pick tomatoes and bury corpses. He needs you out there. Yeah, I need me in here, especially on a day like today. Well, look around. Everybody's amped to 11, pissed at the skin, stirring shit up with each other. I told you, I don't want any of those hateful vibes taken out on me. You said to kill him with kindness. I did say that. Look, they are 
are trying to get a reaction out of you. They want to see you upset. Don't give that to them. Screw them. Universe gives you a sign and you just shove your finger right up its ass. You're telling me to lie. That's your advice. That's your regurgitated bird wisdom. No, not lie. At most, I'm talking about a little strategic omission, maybe minor misleading. Think of it as using the truth to manipulate, but hell, at the end of the day, if that's what keeps people alive, what's the harm? A one-time deal. I will lower my take from 50 to 25%. A lousy 25%. Your people, they get to live like 75% kings. Come an enemy, come and go. Or facing evil brings good people together. Same thing. It's just that no one ever thinks that they're the evil one. get what you're trying to do here, what you're trying to build. I'm not saying I agree with your methods, but I get it. You're building a network. You're making people contribute for the greater good. Makes sense. But you should know that Rick Grimes has a history of not working well with others. Mm. Is that so? Rick wasn't the original leader here. My mom was. She was doing a really good job of it. And she died not long after Rick showed up. Same with my brother, same with my dad. So everything was peachy here for what? Years? And then Rick shows up and suddenly you're an orphan. That is the saddest story I've ever heard. Good thing for you. He's not in charge anymore. Doesn't matter. His ego's out of control. He'll find a way to screw things up, to try and do things his way to take over. That's what he did with my mom. That's what he'll do again. What exactly are you proposing to be done about that? I am my mother's son. I can be the leader she was. That's what this place needs. That's what you need. So I should put you in charge. That's what you're saying. We'd be much better off. Yeah. Uh, yeah. All right, all right, all right. Point made. Still beating, right? You know, I'm thinking, Spencer. I'm thinking how Rick threatened to kill me, how he clearly hates my guts. But he is out there right now gathering shit for me to make sure I don't hurt any of the fine people that live here. He is swallowing his hate and getting shit done. That takes guts. And then there's you. The guy who waited for Rick to be gone so he could sneak over and talk to me to get me to do his dirty work so he could take Rick's place. So I gotta ask, if you want to take over, why not just kill Rick yourself and just take over? What? No, no, I didn't, I don't. You know what I'm thinking? Because I have.
embarrassing. There they are. They were inside you the whole time. You did have guts. I've never been so wrong in my whole life. Thought you were smarter than this. Guess not. <laughs> You're not gonna shoot me, kid. Um, yeah. I will. I'm not going back. So you just pull that trigger if that's what you're gonna do, little lady. How about this? How about I go my way, you go yours, and we never see each other again? How about no? You know, when your mom and dad, when they locked me up, they told me I was gonna be good for something, that I would help people see that things could change. And they did. Holy shit, did they ever. For everybody but me. I mean, look around, Alexandria is a goddamn wonderland. But my part, it's just four walls and a bedpan. Rules are rules. My mom decides, not me. But you can. You know, it's just like when we have our little chats together. You're not letting me go. You're just not seeing me leave. You know, there's nothing out there for you. For anyone. Yep. You know me. You know me better than anyone's known me in a very long time. So, I promise, I promise you that I'm not gonna hurt anyone. Even if they try to hurt me, I promise you I won't hurt them. But I gotta go. Thank you. Hey. Were you in my room? You want it back? Keep it. It'll help you find your way. But if I see you again, I'll shoot. Yeah, I would. Clearly, we are not jiving. And, you know, to be honest with you, I totally understand the position here, and you gotta be, like, a tough guy and keep everybody in line. I mean, hell, you know, I had guys just like you to keep my shit tight. All right, maybe not just like you. I hell, if I had up some monster your size, things would have turned out different. Look, whether you like me or not, I will be joining this team, so maybe we should find a way to get along, you know, and stop pissing on each other's roofs. You will never be one of us. You're too loud, too weak, too full. Ego. I mean, it ain't ego if I really am that awesome. You are a waste. An alpha. Let's see it. So, cards on the table then. Cool, I dig that. See, I'm not here for you. I am here for alpha. So you go ahead and you throw your little test at me, you scowl and throw me on the ground like a five and down Frankenstein. I don't give a shit. See, big man. I ain't going anywhere. Finally, something we can both agree on. You won't be going anywhere. Wait a minute, you just 
make a goddamn joke, I would be impressed if I wasn't so pissed off right now. <laughs> 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 <laughs>